The requirements in many industrial applications are constantly increasing. Specifications are becoming more demanding. The issue of permeation plays an important role in applications in which gas loss needs to be prevented. Here, the gas penetrates a solid, such as rubber, and diffuses. In high-pressure applications, resistance to explosive decompression must also be considered in addition to permeation. The permeation process can be divided into three stages, and this is exemplified by an O-ring. When permeation begins, the molecules accumulate on the surface of the O-ring. This is called absorption. Diffusion describes the penetration and migration of the gas through the O-ring. As soon as molecules escape on the atmospheric side, for example, detach from the surface of the O-ring again, we refer to this as desorption. The entire permeation process is primarily subject to individual parameters, such as pressure difference, temperature, and time. This process can be explicitly influenced via the manufacturer-specific material properties. The diffusion of the molecules through the material is the rate-determining step in permeation, which is why the choice of material or its composition is of such great importance. With increasing permeation, the gas loss increases, for example. Elastomeric materials consist of three-dimensional networks of polymer molecules. These are capable of reversibly absorbing large deformations. During permeation, the gas molecules diffuse through the O-ring, depending on the framework parameters just mentioned. The seal absorbs additional gas molecules until the saturation limit is reached, according to the respective framework parameters. In applications that involve pressures of approximately 30 to 400 bar and a sudden drop in pressure, there is also the danger of explosive decompression. In the case of such a strong, abrupt drop in pressure, the penetrated molecules cannot escape quickly enough from the matrix of the elastomer and form gas bubbles, analogous to diver's disease. The material structure of conventional O-rings is thus permanently and irreversibly destroyed and functional reliability is no longer guaranteed. The formation of cracks is a typical damage pattern resulting from this. In some cases, the cracks can even extend into the surface. This damage pattern inside the ring usually presents itself to the observer as blistering on the surface. In Freudenberg brand seals, the design and material properties are matched to such an extent that the ideal balance is achieved with the best possible benefits for the application in question. Permeation optimized materials with excellent resistance to explosive decompression, which also meet the requirements of NORSOC M710, among other standards, are available. Freudenberg sealing technologies has extensive capabilities for characterizing and simulating sealing properties. Thanks to continuous optimization of materials and designs, Freudenberg Sealing Technologies is ready to meet tomorrow's requirements. Freudenberg, innovating together.